Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev, welcome back to this Let's Play of U4 as Russia. Yeah, we're trying to beat down Spanish. They earned it. They refused to become my subject state when they could, ages and ages ago. And there's the order extension done, fantastic. Siege of something something is done. Naples, good, move on. Let's see if we can intercept some of his... Uh, ships. Hopefully, it's not moving a ton of ships, a ton of transports out. Uh, we're gonna go uh, colonize. Where? Something that they move. Yeah, that's not really my first first choice for colonizing, especially since my uh, subject states are colonizing stuff over there. Conquest of Siberia, that's fair enough, but you're not going to get around to it for a while. As that, reco uh, as, uh, that would entail a fair bit of areas over there. Huh. And I'm not on Europe yet. Uh, fine, I'm gonna go with that mission. Uh, that should uh, we, get, we should get claims on the things we need. Yeah, a bit of Siberia, a bit of this. Wait, do we have a claim? Okay, <laughs> not sure when we got a claim on Beijing, but that's fine. We are gonna go. Uh, for a piece, right, Brunei. We're now out of the woods. With our points, we're gonna finish off this. Right, let's go for the shopping list. Province development. Richest provinces. Sort by war enemies. Uh, definitely Brunei itself. And that's it, actually. Next is uh, Cebu. Isn't that one of the provinces next door? Yeah, that's fine then. Okay, and we're gonna remove Sulu. And uh, gonna take his fort. And then basically take whatever we can. In these, this Arpi, Arp, uh, archipelago, that's the word. Can we actually finish him entirely? Do you have enough cap for that? Huh. That's fairly cheap too. 191 points and we have that. Well then. Thank you for playing, Brunei. Nice knowing you. Didn't think they were that cheap. Oh yes, of course, that's why they're so cheap. This is uh, all <laughs> colonial territory. Oh, I should have thought of this. Ah, uh, that's why. Gah. Do I have any quick war I can just waltz in and win? You are a subject state. Yeah, you're pretty pathetic. So it's Busoka. I'm gonna need one army up here to kill, kill rebels, but... Uh. What are your forts and how many? You have two forts, you have two forts. Mothbolt level four fort. Fully maintain fort. Yeah, uh, force march Move here, or rather here. Let's start, let's start to clear out this little area, since that's where someone else, someone else could actually get that if we're not careful. 
And Mombasa, I don't think, has any friends either. But they're a bit uh, tri tricky to deal with, given the shoreline. Um, Australia? Australia would work. I mean, we don't wouldn't core anything there. But we could take anything from Pegu. Easily enough. Yeah, why the hell not? Let's sort these troops out. And see if we can get a quick war. The Spanish war is going to last a long time anyway. Uh, gonna arrive in November. Oh, that's fine. We're getting there. Um, they largely managed to escape those pesky ships. Dang it, you got out with your army, didn't you? I think you did. Can I catch you? Uh, 15th? No, I'm not gonna catch you. Okay, that's fine then. Let's go and clear this up. Oh, his fleet moved around. Okay. Let's move here instead then. Yeah, they moved out that huge doom stack that was there. Dang it! Not sure where the hell they're gonna go with it, but... That's gonna cause problems. That is gonna cause problems indeed. Oh yeah! Forgot about the sightseeing rebels. Oh, they're gonna go down and fight Austria for me. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, Castilla de la Vea. Great, move on. Oh dear, four tributaries, huh? Always so aggressive. Hmm. Have you arrived? You finally arrived. And I need you up here to blockade. At least for the time being. I need this to fall before his navy arrives, basically. <laughs> if I can even do that. Uh, it's probably worth forcing a breach here. Yeah, I want that, because I just want this darn thing to fall, so I can kick him out of the... Well, anything that is in Europe, basically. So that's what we're gonna try for. And you guys have to move back into Europe proper, because there's gonna be a billion and then some rebellions. Uh, so are you gonna kill the rebels for me, or are they... <laughs> Either way, we win. You're gonna move south. Definitely. I need at least a few armies. Here. You arrive there, good. Is that a fort? No. Uh, that is not a fort. That is, though. Uh, take that one at least. Actually, you can go straight to the fort, and we're gonna have this little dude run all the way around. Korea, no. We're gonna kill those rebels. Thank you, Austria. That's nice of you. So let's see, what about army? Yeah, that was pretty much the army you had that escaped on those fleets. Unfortunately. 
But that's okay. Uh, are my troops in position for a quick war? Uh, they are. If I had the diplomat. Still heading back. Couple more days. Yeah, we're gonna just do a lightning war on Dongo here. Do like so, and you're just gonna march straight into the other fort. And I have to wait a month before we declare another war. Then again, the other ones might not be quite so lightning. are in position. If I could just... Yeah, we need to wait until a month has passed before we can declare war. I'm gonna fight Australia and basically annihilate them. Oh, rebels. How nice. Okay, so we did build up a big army here. Not big enough, though. They're gonna be contained there for the most part. We've arrived, so we're gonna take control of that island. And hopefully after this we're gonna be able to take control of uh, most of Spain's outlying areas. So at least we can focus them down to this area. And have, have them e make them easier to beat. That's my goal. We'll see how long this this takes. Uh, that's fine. Stop enforcing here. Stop force marching. Are we ready, ready to declare war on Australia? I believe we are. Pegu, do Pegu have friends? Yes, of course they do. They're still allied to Jaunpur. So I'm not gonna co them. Because I'm fairly certain Jaunpur would join in, right? Oh yeah. So it doesn't really matter. Uh, either we take some provinces from them and just... ...pad our uh, cap a bit here. Pad our uh, current war extension. Or we smash these guys to pieces. Let's see, next HRE war. We don't have a truce with Lorraine. Never mind, we do have a truce with Lorraine. No, we don't, let's see. Okay. Lorraine and Dietmarken. I don't think he's gonna I don't think Austria's ever gonna ally Dietmarken. And these guys are guaranteed by Köln. Hey, that's perfect. Then okay, then in that case, we're gonna attack Lorraine. That's gonna bring in Austria and all the other what's remains of electors. And uh, yeah. See what we can do there. There, there went the Australian army. Thank you for playing, guys. Oh, fantastic. The cloud, you know, all the modifiers are gone. I want your monarch points, people. I really want your monarch points, so let's call it yet. And then, I want your points. Burgers. Uh, Grant Monopoly Chargers. Yeah, that's not going to push you high enough. Um, yeah, let's recruit the minister we're never going to use. And then ask for your points. 
You are at 48. Yeah, that's not worth it. I could even do that, actually. Because they have enough influence. Yeah, we're just we're just gonna donate this time around. We have enough money. And then we want your points. Oh, I completely forgot to look at that. Damn it. No point cap. Like, ugh. Stupid me. We lost precious, precious diplomats because of that. Incredibly stupid move of me. Didn't even consider having a look up there. Uh, how many points did I lose? That was annoying. Because I was at 900 something earlier. I might have just lost 100 points. Ah, uh, for... Well, it, it, again, we're gonna need a lot more points than that in order to actually finish this, but... Annoying. Uh, I need a warning, like... Oh, if you do this action, you're gonna be above the cap. Hey, Firenze. Convert. Do I want to do this? Not unless I... If, I'm, if I get capped, we're gonna buy tax. But not before. If I'm capped, I can't, and can't spend it on... Uh, on um, other things. Did I encounter his army? No, nope, but I'm about to. It's gonna be a brief affair. I think we're gonna send a spy to Ming. At some point we're gonna fight Ming. Should be tons of revolts. Hansbachian, Brandbergian, yeah, that's fine. These are gonna be converted really fast, so. That's cool. Okay, you did actually survive. Wow. Good on you. You live to fight another day. Spain wants peace. Uh, that's great news. It doesn't really matter. We want this province here done. It has to be fall. That, ha that fort has to fall. Uh, that's key for this whole damn war. In my mind, at least. We're suffering tons of attrition. Trying to secure all everything else, but that's okay. And don't go and go and kill. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take this fort before I can take him over, I think. Uh, how many thousands? That's less than I feared. You can... okay. You take charge of this. Move up there. It's a fort, so... Nothing bad will happen even if we get there too late. But actually, that would mean the fort had fallen. Yes, it would have been bad. That would have been, but there, there's your transport fleet, so you did move into Asia. Seriously, a 1k stack. Okay. Did you move your forces? I don't know where the heck you moved that big stack then. But that's your transport fleet. On the bright side, you didn't move into Asia, which was kind of my great fear. everything and be done with Australia. And you're willing to make peace already. Well, I'm sorry, but the only peace I'll accept is your annihilation. 
And I don't think you'd be willing to take that just yet. Wait a second, you have a problem. Oh, that's because I hold it. Ah, never mind. Yeah, you're not quite ready to be completely destroyed. Give it time. You'll come to accept it. There goes Toledo. Uh, well, at least the artillery can go to Valencia. Don't think we have an artillery stack over there. And the other two can park in Madrid for now. You move north. Need more rebels. Rebel. Uh, more on rebel busting. Cologne declares war on Liege. <laughs> My goodness, Cologne is super aggressive. Uh, he's a militarist, so I shouldn't be too surprised. But oh, well. here's the forces of Holland destroyed. Don't need you on that army anymore. To control the Bari. Yeah, uh, if we take, take land from the other two here, it's going to limit... Uh, it's going to lengthen the uh, time before we can make peace with with um, Spain, but that's okay. You're already ready to die. That's a bit overextension, so let's eat you. That wasn't much. Or at 40%. I really thought Brunei would have had a lot more cost, but I've completely forgot that this is actually old colonial territory. Uh, so it doesn't cost any overextension. Which of course means this isn't going to cost overextension either, or most of these small islands. Just need this pesky fort to fall, and that could take a while. Mm, Stay reabolished. If we're quick about this, we might just get another chunk out of this guy. Siege of Valencia, finally. It's gonna sink most of his fleet. Ah, uh, you can move there. The double stack can move up towards the Empire somewhere. Uh, go to Paris, actually, for now. At least one bit of his fleet going down, hopefully. But then again, he has a commander, we do not. And he chose to retreat. After sinking four of my heavies. Ugh. take from Spain. Um, let's see. His richest province is definitely and as much of the overseas stuff as we possibly can after that. We shall see. I'm gonna probably gonna need to take this fort before we can eat Pegu. But it's, it is gonna happen. Let's get a little bit at Siege Pip. Try to speed that up. 
So this is actually a... Oh my goodness, that's a level 8 fort. I didn't think he had any left. That's rather annoying. And I think we're just going to repair the fleet. Uh, do you want to build more ships? Should have the force limit for it, right? <laughs> Darn well hope so. Oh yeah. Yeah, fine. We're going to build another... Cadria uh, boom boats. I completely ignored the naval ships in this game. Or, um... Trade ships, rather. Most of the, most, mostly because I simply couldn't afford it until quite recently. And at that point, who really cares? I mean, I control every trade node anyway. I did click. I'm mean, almost certain I clicked. So I'm waiting. We're waiting. Come on, game. You can compute this. I know you can. Or not. Let's try again. Okay, now we clicked. There we go. Okay, never mind. Didn't click. Whoops. <laughs> okay, I think I'm going to take a short break here. Uh, Spain is mostly beaten. They still have forces. Uh, so... Yeah, I don't know where they're hiding them, though. Uh, mostly on the islands, I suspect. We shall see what we can do about that. I could make peace with them right now. Actually, no, we couldn't. They're at medium. I have to knock their war enthusiasm completely down. But we're getting there. Uh, this one's about to fall. Uh, we're going to have to get through here. I could probably send my navy over there once it's repaired. And then we shall see. As for Pegu and Australia, they're going to need a bit more time to come around, I think. No, never mind. He's actually willing to die. Well, in that case, let's have a look. Can we make peace here? Mm. Oh, cool. I could actually do this. Oh, but I want that. As well. So we're going to have to wait. I need to control this territory as well. And then we can take all of Pegu as well. And that would be great. Eliminating both Australia and Pegu. For now, though, time for a break. Thank you for watching.